slash mob in Philadelphia. What was supposed to be a weekend barbecue ended with bottles being thrown at police. Good afternoon. I'm Rahel Solomon. And I'm Jim Donovan. Much of the rowdiness was captured on cell phone video. Eyewitness News reporter Henry Rossoff walks us through the video and spoke with neighbors about what happened last night. Videos posted publicly across social media show about 500 teenagers coming face to face with police near the Lonnie Young Recreation Center. <laughs> Neighbor Pete Green says the whole thing started off as an unauthorized party with a DJ on the basketball court. We found this poster shared online inviting people to a barbecue around 6 o'clock last night until whenever. Green says the crowd was a bit loud but well behaved at first. The teenagers went all together, the music, music. Police say things got out of hand when they tried to disperse the crowd. They proceeded to throw bottles at police. Neighbors say they didn't see bottles being thrown, and we couldn't find any video of bottle throwing online. But you can see kids dancing on cars and taunting police. Officers decided to wait out the crowd and did not make any arrests. And after a few hours, everyone simply went home. Though Captain Drew Techner on the scene did have some stern words for those responsible for the kids in the crowd. I know it's nice to have the fresh air and to be out with their friends on a summer night, but parents have to be aware what their children are doing, who they're with, and what they're getting involved in. They need to be home at a decent hour. We did find lots of pieces of glass all along the sidewalk and street near the rec center. Police say none of their officers nor anyone in the crowd was seriously injured. They also didn't find any major property damage. In Germantown, Henry Rossoff, CBS3 Eyewitness News.